101. Stardom 101. Stardom 101. It's the Stardom 101 Magazine Podcast. Shine your light on today's tastemakers and innovators. It's the Stardom 101 Magazine Podcast. Oh, yes, it's Stardom 101 Magazine Podcast here back on iHeartRadio. Thank you guys for tuning into the platform. You already know how we do. We do this each and every week where we reach, reach out to prominent stars, people that's on the rise to stardom, literally doing their thing out here in society. And today I got my guy Slay Powder in the building. What's going on, bro? How you feeling, man? What's up, G-Man? Thank you for having me. Absolutely, Thanks, man. man. Absolutely, man. It's been a pleasure, man. Shout out to my guy, Bama the Great, too. He already told me you was coming on. He said, that's the family. That's the home team. I said, okay, let's do it. <laughs> yes, sir. That's, that's what's up, boy, man. man. Yeah, he good peoples, yeah. man. Great guy. Great guy, man. But you got you got some music out, bro. You got, tell me about some previous music um, that you got, got, got out right now so the listeners can get in, tap in and kind of get updated on what's circulating right now. Uh, for their digital, uh, you know, I mean, for the for the playbacks and all that good stuff. What's going on right now? All right. Well, so um, me and Bama got a project uh, um, called uh, "There Will Be Blood," and um, that's available on all uh, DSPs. And I have a solo project called um, "God in the Garden of Beasts." Woo! That's I hard. like that title. That's hard. <laughs> 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 that title yeah. hard. I like that. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. You know, okay. Um, that's um that's completely produced by me. No features on there. That's just strictly me. So uh, you get a good opportunity to uh, hear who I am, hear how I'm coming on there, man. You know what I'm saying? So and I, I got a single out too called uh, "God Is Good," mm-hmm. and me and Emma, we working on another project right now too. Mm. So, so, so it's a couple of things you referenced there. I got I we, we got to dissect that. You gave me a lot of a lot of material right there. First of all, you produced you produced you produced too, bro. Did I hear you correctly? You produced? Yeah, yeah, Whoa. yeah, yeah. Um, 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 there will be blood. The first joint that me and Bama did, mm-hmm. I produced. It, it, it was eight total tracks on there. I did four, mm. and got and the beast is ten on there. I did all of those. She, she. So you, you've been doing this production thing. <laughs> yeah, 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 man. Well, look, man. I, I'm like, I, I'm, a, I'm a, I'm a fan of music. I'm a student of music. Really, uh-huh. music is my life, man. And my love, my, my real passion. So that's what's um, up, I man. Really like to pour everything into the music. Yeah, that's what's up, man. I noticed some of them titles had a lot of G-O-D up in there, man. Is that intentional? Is that where you're coming from? There's a Is there a past that connect you to that? Like, you know, everybody, some people just throw it in there for popularity, but I I, I heard it. I think I heard it twice. I said, all right, well, me, I got to ask you, what's going on with that G-O-D? <laughs> well, yeah, it, it's all right. This way, I'm, not, I'm not an overly religious person, you know what I see. I'm saying? I, but I do believe in um a higher spirituality yes sir i believe in, in the god in each and every one of us you know mm-hmm. like that that um you know how they used to the, the old cartoons used to have the demon and the angel on yeah <laughs> yeah i know exactly what you're talking you know, about that, yeah. that god inside of you that's that's um that's your higher self man your mm. your greatest aspiration of yourself and what you can be um mm. what you can mean to your community to your family you know mm-hmm. so I really like try to lean into that, man. It's 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 something that's important to me. That's what's up, man. That's what's up, and and, and some upcoming projects too. Um, anything in the pipeline that's coming up too, or or the joints you already referenced. That's that's what's in the pipeline. Uh, no. Nah, um, well, yes, yeah, it's, it's um me and Bama. We doing uh, there will be blood part two. Okay. Um, we already about maybe like halfway into that, and and I'm doing um a solo joint too. I'm I'm still um I'm I'm trying to come up with a title but i got i got a whole bunch of shit man like a mm-hmm. um i'm gonna do a vault talk i'm gonna call it vault talk it's, a, it's just a whole bunch of old stuff that i did that i i never released i see i'm just about to put everything you're about to flood it you're about to flood the market <laughs> yeah, yeah. ain't nothing wrong with that now you i know you got, got a lot of <laughs> you said, ain't no time to play in it hell no <laughs> That's what's oh. up, bro. Now, now I notice there's a lot of material, right, already in the audio archives. Are, is is the plan, or or and you tell me the thought process to put out some videos to go with certain songs as well, too, or you just gonna let the audio circulate and do what it do? 
Well, no, nah, I mean, at, at this day and age, when you got to have visual content to okay. um, to match the audio content, you know what I'm saying? Mm-hmm. So you, you shoot videos yourself or um, you do it like the, the live videos where, like, I have a, um, the guy that's good, I got a live video on um, mm. just me and, and the microphone at the gas station just rocking out, you know what I'm saying? Oh, okay. So we, like that, too, just... You, you know, give give the the fans and the listeners an opportunity to get to know you on on the right. um, on, on the audio and visual level. Absolutely. Now, do you, you um do you do some movies and, and some film too? Do you produce? Are you into the movie thing too? Some film? You see yourself kind of getting into that? I'm a movie buff, bro. I love movies. <laughs> <laughs> That's um, what's up. I actually want to get into directing, but I haven't done that as of yet. You know yeah, what I'm saying? but I. I that's definitely something I want to explore. That's what's up, man. I I, I can see it for you doing some series and, and putting some stuff out there, the visual concept. That's what's up. <laughs> oh, man. And, and you I, and Ben, but... I'm, I'm sorry. No, go ahead. No, go ahead. Keep going. You good. No, I'm just saying I, I got a lot of respect for um for the craft of, of movie making. It's the same as, as making music. You know what I'm saying? You're telling the yeah. story. You're conveying your emotions mm-hmm. and, and, and how you feel about whatever it is that you're talking about and you mm-hmm. can do it in boring bullshit where you could do it in a fly way that, mm-hmm. that sticks out stands out to people and you know what I'm saying like I, I have a lot of love for for um for, for good directors you know the Coen mm-hmm. brothers mm-hmm. Quentin Tarantino um Scorsese mm-hmm. and shit guys too you know Tim Burton I just, oh yeah I'm, I'm a fan of the art you know what you're saying? a fan of the art art <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> That's what's so, up. And you and Bama did the um the joint with um Project Pat too, right? I think I, I think yeah, it, yeah, 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 that was fun. Ooh, that's yeah. so <laughs> I look, I already know about that one. That's look that joint still 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 in the street, still hot. <laughs> man, yeah, man, look, man. Um, um Project Pat has has been like a a favorite of mine forever, yeah. dog. Like yes, the that Gabby Green and that and that um Mr. Don't Play. Yes, sir. Still, today you know what I'm saying? yeah yeah it's a so legend it, right it there. was an honor and a, and a privilege to to be able to uh, do a joint with him man yeah for real. that's that's fire man and uh king cinema bro is that is that the con- your conglomerate your imprint is that is that what the what it is is that the movement see like you uh it, it, right there I, <laughs> you, you can tell how much i love movies and yeah and uh, the cinematic side of it. yeah king cinema that's something me and my dog um Spit used to talk about back in the day, and I, wow. I was like, "Yeah, be the name of my joint." And uh, I'm I'm looking to find talent, you know, kind of younger guys to put yeah. on there. That's somebody who got something to say that's that that's visual. When you, when you hear him say it, you can see it in your yeah. mind. Yeah, you know? yeah. We definitely in a different time right now, man, bro. Where we're like media content is is important, right? You know, you got to go beyond the artistry. People are consuming in a different different way right now than they used to do back in the day. It's a little different when that digital age uh, for you, oh, yeah. bro, is that media content a part of your strategy, your marketing promotion strategy to make sure you got um, that media popping as well too, good content out there circulating? Yeah, yeah, it is, you know, but um, I don't know, man. Excuse me. I guess I'm kind of stubborn a little bit. Yeah. And, and I <laughs> about as much um, as I should, like, like I'm not on Instagram a whole lot, you know what I'm saying? I, yeah. I'm a fan man. I, I got uh, I got a wife and I got children and shit like that. So I, I'm busy Absolutely. a lot, mm-hmm. you know. So I'm not just like on social media and stuff all the time like that. But mm-hmm. it's something I, that I know I need to do more of, and mm-hmm. it's something I'm interested in. You feel me? Now what's up, bro? I know the festival season is coming up. You know the summertime is coming up. Spring is about to blossom. You know everybody gonna come outside. Whole yep. first first part of the year for you, yep. bro. Is any meet and greets? Is any shows on a radar? Any tours? Any festivals? You know, festival season coming. Uh, something maybe down the line, summertime. Anything like uh, anything that we can look forward to? Um, I don't really have anything um concrete at the moment, but I'm definitely gonna be outside this, this yes, season. Yes, sir. Yeah. <laughs> Especially with the music we got coming out, you know. You got to uh, make yourself available. The, the, the best ability is availability. You got to make yourself available for the people to 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 experience and feel and touch you and, and see where you're coming from. So 
I'm definitely going to be out there with it, man. That's what's up, bro. You still doing the poetry thing, bro? Do you still write or maybe even songwrite for other people? Do, is the is the pen available for the other folks that's tapping into, you know, sometimes they need they need a verse or two. <laughs> oh, <yeah. laughs> If the price is right, man. Yeah, right <laughs> yes, um, man. But um, yeah, my 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 youngest daughter, um, uh, she she doing a little rapper right right now. Her name is uh Lay, and nice. uh, you know helping her get her stuff together and shit. But outside yeah. of that, I don't really write too much poetry no more. You know, yeah. I just um, but I I write all my own lyrics and you yeah. know that's what that's, that's what keep my pen strong right now. Just um. Um, listening to other guys and and um, seeing how they come in and and, and being inspired by uh, the different genres of music. Because I'm not like you know a guy that that be hating on other people's shit. Yeah, you know, I, I feel you. Appreciate everybody else's music too, so mm-hmm. it's inspirational to me. Like I was just listening um, to this girl named Caribou. I think uh, little little Yachty signed her. Okay, I'm like yo, that kind of hard. Bro. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> been a fan of Lil Yachty like that, no disrespect, yeah. you know, but I'm just saying, just to give you a, um, the proper scope of who I am and, Absolutely. and, and how I feel about, about music and other people's art, man, I just really, I'm, I'm a fan, I appreciate yeah. it, and keep me sharp, you know. That's what's up, so you're, yeah, you appreciate the art, that's what it is, man, you know, you know, good, authentic music is will always re- uh, resonate uh, with people, you know what I mean, like myself, you know, I, I, pre- I appreciate artistry. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. Give me, give me you. And everybody has a different, unique template. You feel me? But what's going on, Slade, you and I know there's a lot of copycats. <laughs> that, that, that's, it's a lot of leeches. You know yes, sir. Yes, sir. Wait for you to do your things so they can try and um, take your shit and run off with you. Yep. Which I, yep. I, you don't have the courage and the bravery to be yourself in. Yeah. Maybe to, maybe to fail. You know what I'm mm. saying? That's why I wanted to. I wanted to make my first project that that God in the Garden of Beast. Mm-hmm. No features, no guest production. Mm. The opportunity to to actually see who I am. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Yeah. I feel you on that one. That's that's a good look, man. Any um any merch drops, anything like that, bro? Do you are you plan on any, even looking at, or maybe even maybe uh you know considering some merch potentially down the line? Nothing right now, but you see yourself maybe dropping some merch for the for the fans for the listeners. Oh, for sure, man. Yeah, I got a um, I got a clothing line. That's it. It's in the works. It's called okay. Snow Mountain. Nice. And, um, yeah, that shit gonna be cold. I, <laughs> I already got a couple of pieces. You know what I'm saying? But yeah, um, I want to make it make it more available on a larger scale. So yeah, that's definitely in the works. Snow Mountain, Snow Mountain, Snow Mountain. With yes, sir. Yes, sir. You know, that. Yeah. That's what's up, man. Last question for you, Slade. What's the last thing you want to leave the listeners, man, uh, that's tapping in right now? They're they tuning in from all over the world uh, to this platform, all, literally all over the world, bro. What's one thing you want to say to your fans, your listeners right now, so they can definitely keep it locked with you? Um, you can find me on all platforms, um, Slade Powder. That's S-L-A-D-E-P-O-W-B-E-R. You know what I'm saying? I got a lot of love and appreciation for those that e- even take the time to check me out and um and, and, and give me a listen, give Bama a listen. You know, that, that's another good brother, man. That's a family mm-hmm. man. And, mm-hmm. and he cares about his about his his people and his community and and I I think that we, we all should um take more time and care and consideration to do that, man. Care care about each other, care mm-hmm. about our community. Um and, and, and stick together and move forward in a positive way. Get this mm. fucking money that they owe us. That they yes. owe us this bread, man. You know yes, what I'm saying? Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Um, Perfect segue, bro. Yeah. <laughs> Perfect. <laughs> for real, man. Well, that's man, good. I appreciate you for giving me the opportunity, man. I, 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 hey, man. Respect, bro. Thank hey, you. Absolutely, man. Any anytime, man. Starting the voice for the voiceless, man. That's what we do. We feature the prominent. Uh, you ain't got to be celebrity in my platform to be a star. You already star for being who you are. We appreciate you, bro. We definitely do. <laughs> Absolutely, man. Y'all already tapped in. Y'all know what it is. It's Starter Magazine, Our Heart Radio. Y'all know what we do. This is On The Rise. My guy, Slave Powder, delivered as always. We see you guys next week with another episode just like this. Until next time, be blessed, be safe, and see ya. Are you on the rise to stardom? Well, Get featured in the next issue of Stardom 101 Magazine and promote your business or products today. Text MAG to 
1-800-550-8647 or visit stardom101mag.net. You're listening to the Stardom 101 Magazine Podcast with Christopher Boykin. Be sure to subscribe and download this episode and continue to listen to Stardom on iHeartRadio or wherever you get your podcasts.